Welcome. Welcome. We're having a bit of a crisis. <sighs> Incomfortability in community spread illness. <coughs> Pardon me. Sam's got the COVID. It's COVID. I think I do too. My nose is running. <laughs> Let me tell you, the table is oh more full God. than it's ever been. I don't know what's wrong with me mentally. I mean it. Let's have a discussion about that. Okay. I don't know that you're ready for that. I was talking to the viewers. Oh, well. Viewers, do you ever feel so overwhelmed by your own hole? <laughs> <laughs> your many holes. Oh, sweet Jesus. They're just endless. They're endless holes. I mean, I've now migrated from the Goodwills and such, mm -hmm. Salvation Army, to flea markets, now to Facebook Marketplace. Oh, no. Oh no. Can you imagine what garage sale season is going to bring? I don't know that I even want to talk about it. We really got to get this under control. I have got to get this under control before April. Yeah. I, d I really do. That's like right around the corner. I, if anybody lives in and around the Des Moines area that is a professional organizer, I need you over here now for free. <laughs> All right. All right. And with that, welcome back to Thrift You. Welcome. Welcome. We hope you don't have the COVID-19. Don't breathe. In the 2020. Right. The Rona. Don't breathe on me. Right. Or do. We're doing, what is it? Personal distance? What's it called? Social distancing. Social distancing. God, I can't. I didn't know that was a thing until I, <laughs> I've seen several people mention <laughs> it today. I like all the new words we're using. Mm -hmm. Community spread, social distancing, mm -hmm. you know. Wow. We got a thing happening. <laughs> but listen, the good news is... I'm just hoping to be off work for a couple of weeks, and I just know they won't let me. Yeah, I doubt it. <clears throat> well, you know, here's the situation. Viewers, friends, foes, co-porters, um... I work for the lab that is making the test kits, and so um, they're all about the money. Mm -hmm. They're not, I'm not going to be, they're not going to say, hey, Sarah, we're concerned about your safety, walking in and out of people's houses all day. <laughs> My theory is they're going to deploy her to, to the, the people's homes <laughs> to do the testing. And I don't think that that's a wild theory. I think that'll really happen. It might happen. I will alert you if that happens because it could be the last time you see me. <laughs> so I'll get like some super COVID strain. Right. Yeah. Because yeah. you'll just be seeing so many people with the COVID. <laughs> well, I had the Titus, you know. You did have pancreatitis. I did. I, I don't know how that affects year. your. I think I'm immune compromised. System. I, I don't think, think I'm you are. I might be compromised. You're missing a gallbladder. You're not missing a pancreas. <laughs> <laughs> I was very ill, Samantha. You were very ill, but now you're fine. Well, I had to give up the drink. The sauce. <laughs> the devil's juice. <laughs> yeah, I did. Anyway, let's get started. What should we talk about? My haul? I don't know, like how you're feeling today. <laughs> One of the trillions of things <laughs> sitting here on this table. Anything you want. Mm. Mm -hmm. How about these guys? These guys make you happy. <laughs> so at the auction, I picked up um, a box lot, which I normally don't. I think I might have paid five for that, mm -hmm. that box, <clears throat> which is a little high for me at the auction. Like that is high for two. you. I like to pay two for the box. Must have had something you really wanted in the box. Oh, there was those whole Howard kitties. There we go. But uh, anyway, so look at these. Look at these panda salt and pepper shakers. Pretty cute. Mm -hmm. Look at those. Now we're calling this this classroom session. We don't know what we're calling it. Kind of a study session. Yeah, we're calling this. Um, if anybody knows what I have, please comment. It's like study circle. Yeah. Sh anyway. It's a sharing of knowledge. These are worth virtually nothing, by the way. But they're very cute. Oh, God, I love them. Look at them. I mean, so... Oh, and they're filthy also. 
Uh, um, Honestly, you could probably get like 10, 15 bucks for them. Yeah, it, maybe, yeah, there's not a lot of them listed. Maybe one other pair. And I don't even know if they're on Face or on eBay. They could be on Etsy. I don't know. I don't know why I'm not selling everything on Etsy, frankly. I would get a lot more money. I don't know. Um, so, yeah, I'll Etsy's kind of a 15. I'll probably get, I don't know, 12 maybe. Etsy's kind of hard to list on. That's not. Well, it's just longer. It, it feels well, like it, it takes longer. longer than it does because of the, you know, because all the hash, the keywords, and all that. That and like mm -hmm. you have to like. I think that's a good idea, though. I'm select the that. right things. Let's just start with the salt and pepper theme. Okay. You wanna? Let's do it. Let's start with what's in that in that box lot. But there's more. I'm just not gonna show them all. Right. We're kind of trapped in. Once we're set, we're set. <laughs> oh, we, I can't <laughs> move from where I'm at. I about killed her getting into the chair. So yeah. So here's these uh, cute Japan kitties that are. With they pink look faces. They look like they've been abused. Look at these. <laughs> look at these kitties. Or they've been eating their young. <laughs> just got done with a kill <laughs> yeah <laughs> they're survivalist kitties with bows in the serengeti <laughs> serengeti yeah they're pretty cute i i'll tell you too these salt and peppers are in really good shape i mean there's there's no damage on them there's yeah. i don't know probably 15 bucks maybe yeah I don't know. now keep in mind though i paid but you five bucks for the box of right probably tw at least 20 25 sets of salt and pepper shakers yeah, yeah. Here's some cute ones. Check these out. Oh, my shoulder. Careful. Look at these mushrooms. Mushroom. Wow. As everybody knows, mushrooms are all the rage. I, think. I enjoy that. I might be making that up. Yeah, they're if I had to guess, I would say those were from the 60s or the 70s. They're from, I think, the 70s. They could be from the 60s. I don't know. I Based on the way they're like cut. They're pretty cute. I might list these for a, just a hair higher, like around 20, because they're they're pretty cute. And they're you kind of go have to go with like what's popular. Oh yeah, yeah. Like I mean, when strawberries these, are popular, strawberries yeah. just gonna be more expensive. These will go to people who are specifically looking for them, like right. those pandas. Pandas are not a popular decorating style. Right. This is yes, as you all know, or maybe you don't. If you and don't now know. You don't know. Now it's you. Now uh, you, know. you know that 60s, 70s thing is very popular. Look, look at these. These are so g dang cute. Look at their little teeny tiny bird cages with little birdies. It's pretty cute. Oh, aren't those darling? Yes. Yeah, they're their cork stoppers. They're from Japan with little birds. Oh, Hand I painted. love these. Um, oh, these are neat. Oh, I think those are really cool. These aren't marked. I'm pretty positive they're made in Japan, but um, look at that. Look, it's like magic. Oh my god. Look at that. How did you do, do it again? I can't believe it. Whoa! First you have one, then you have two. Mm -hmm. Salt and pepper. Are those neat? I like those. Those are cool. I do too. I, I really would put like those, those in my house. I'm not sure what era these are from. These might be more, maybe late, maybe 50s, early 60s. I'm not sure. Yeah. I don't know. I, I couldn't find any of them. So I might list these like, because they're plain enough. I don't know. And they're kind of tall. They're tall. I yeah, mean, they're, they're big. They're, you know, they're not, they're not like the bird cage. There's these. They're serviceable, whereas Here's the bird, the bird cage, cage is more decorative. decorative. Yeah. Plus, they're kind of, um, I don't know. I just feel like somebody's going to be looking for these. I'm going to list those just a, just a hair higher. Maybe like 22, 25. We'll, we'll go from there. 57. Maybe 108. I don't know. <laughs> so these are super de duper cute. Yeah, they're really cute. Those little old Howard kitties from 1958. Wow, look at the year wow, of you our were... Lord. Yes, it was. Mm -hmm. Now, that I mean, this guy's got a teeny tiny little flea bite right there, but it's I don't even think it's flea bite, I think it's paint loss. Yeah, it's not a chip, it's just a little bit of paint loss. Oh. Anyway, um, 
corks back here missing. But you can get those. Very easy to replace. You can get those at home. These Depot. apparently used to make sound. So apparently when you turned them, they would make sound. The, they don't make sound anymore, but they still have the sound makers in them. These are pretty neat. And I have not worth a whole lot. But you have a plan for them. I have a plan for these. These are going to somebody. And, and take a guess who? Begins with D and ends in E. <laughs> D. Starts e. with D. Ends, ends in, in E. e. <laughs> this is probably going to be in her basket of goodies. <clears throat> I think we should um, insert a little America here, given our current situation. Oh, I think it's more the world. Oh. Check out this beautiful handmade item. Yeah, wowee. It's a bell. It's America. Let it's freedom America. ring. Look ring that. a ring, baby. I'm pretty sure that's a homemade piece right there with a little transfer. Although that transfer is done very, very well. Ah, uh, maybe not. I don't, I don't know. know. That could have been store bought. I don't know. I paid too much for it, but I don't care. Look how cute that would be, though. Uh, you know, Fourth of July. Fourth of July. The Fourth of the July. Put and potter your little Fourth of July vignette. Sure. If it doesn't sell by the Fourth, I'm keeping it for the Fourth of July and my Fourth of July vignettes. Yeah. Uh, oh, look at this. Hey, check this out. Look at this plate. It's got a peach. Pretty check cute. It. Check it out. Oh, I looked it up and I told you I would remember. It's subtil. Yeah. Hang on, you gotta let me see it. You're too blind. Subtil. Caldas da Reina, Reina, Portugal. Portugal. And it's yeah, it went for a lot. It's Portuguese. Yeah, this stuff, I can't find it listed anywhere. Sam did some deep diving. A little studying. A little studying. Yeah. This, it's, I don't know. Like, other stuff goes pretty high. Yeah. I'll probably I, list this for 60. See I would suggest 70. Yeah, it goes because it's high. bigger. It does have a, you know what? And I think this damn chip right here is new. Shoot. A little teeny tiny chip right there on the peach. But, nonetheless, does not affect the yeah. Indeed. Yeah, it's cool. I've never seen anything uh, from this company or anything like it. Mm -mm. I thought maybe it was Italian when I first saw it. No, Portuguese. Portuguese. Usually the Portuguese pieces have that, you know, really uh, vibrant painting and stuff on mm -hmm. them. You don't see stuff like this, but apparently this is a thing. Sure. So we'll see. We'll see how that does. On Facebook Marketplace, I picked up a whole huge lot of blue forget-me-not porcelain stuff. But there's this, oh, there's just, oh, there's so many things. But it's, um, it's all hand-painted. Some of it, I'm a little confused, and I might, I need some help here. Some of it is done in Bavaria. Some of it is done in France, you know, Limoges. Some of it is, uh, maybe Austria? I mean, I get that, but what I don't get, let me show you this. Okay, so. Care for with the shoulder. All right, right. Here, so here's this. Okay, here's this. Just a minute. Whoa. <gasps> you in danger, girl. Okay, that's a terrible sound. Okay, so here's this vanity tray. I hope to sweet Jesus you can see this because it is so gorgeous. Yeah, it's beautiful. So, and that's, oh, there's many, many more pieces. So there's, so there's this, this, you know. And that's the one that was this little Limoges, right? I don't know, but they're all signed by M. Rob, was the artist. Nope, this one's Bavaria. Okay. Okay, this one's Bavaria. Then, wait a minute, is this one signed? Oh, yeah, this yeah. one is signed. Then there's this. Right on the edge, and it's making me nervous. Little perfumey thing, we think. Yeah, we think perfume, maybe oil. But, okay, so this is a vanity set, right? We think so. I don't, you know, here's the thing. We're not 
fancy vanity set. We're also not from 1890 to the early 1900s. <laughs> so just what I've seen other people, maybe Sue talk about stuff like this. Mm -hmm. Maybe George, the antique nomad. I'm positive. I say I'm positive. I don't know. Anyway, it's a uh, you know it's got moriage and stuff. It's it's oh god, it's gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Then there's these two, these you know these. There's no stopper thing on this. I don't know what it was for. This does have the cork in it, um, but I do not have the wherewithal to get it out of there. <laughs> anyway, so this one is marked. This one stamped Bavaria. Okay. This one says favorite, I think Bavaria, but interestingly, they're all signed by M. Dot Rob. Two B's. This one is stamped France. Francais. A. K. France. I'm pretty sure it's the bar. And this one which is also signed, this tray, which is gorgeous. France! I, I don't get it. I, mm, I haven't looked at a map. Is France next to Bavaria? Does anybody know? No, no, definitely not. At any rate, this is, believe it or not, I have actually listed something as I'm showing it. <laughs> I just listed this because I love it so very, very much. That I'm afraid that I'm gonna keep it if I don't list it. Yeah, you gotta list it. Yeah, I do. Cause this lady, you know, sweet old lady. And she's old. She had, had listed for like. She, I bought. Much less than what you could definitely get it for. Oh yeah. I mean, I bought the whole lot for 125 bucks and I am telling you I've got a table full of it. Yeah. I almost so, feel disrespectful saying that's what you got it for. <laughs> I do too. I'm embarrassed to say I got it for 100. Because that little set there, yeah, you're starting it out what like? I started it at 140. Yeah, we'll see. See, there's these. Um, these are candle holders. Look at that. That one does have damage, but it's on the back side of it, so it's okay. And it really, truthfully, this is like what this and that stopper. And there was like one other part that had a chip. One other little chip. Oh, the crack on the perfume. Uh, no, on the stopper. Yes. So there's this crack. There, there's a crack on the stopper. We, I learned that I can't hold this up. You can't see it. <laughs> so there's a crack on the stopper, which is no big deal. And because all this stuff you can turn around, that's got a, a chip on it. Mm -hmm. And. Oh, there's a little, ch I'll show you this other really neat little piece. Okay, and this one is marked Austria. Now understand that, um, you know, this stuff looks very, very, oh no, and this has got M. Rob on it. I'm telling you, it's Look. all the same. I'm this telling you. This has got you. M. Rob on it. No, that one's different. Or maybe not, is that signed? I'm looking for it. I bet it does. Yeah, they're usually signed. So I don't get it. I unless this artist is um, traveling throughout Europe, painting things and then signing mm, them. I don't I, see I, it. I don't know. Look at this. God, I love this stuff. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Oh, it is so neat. <laughs> I looked this up the other day or yesterday, and it's it's like from the 1880s. It was made between the 1880s and the early 1900s. That's insane to me. Let me just like, that's what here. blows my mind about this stuff. You're, like, holding history. history. You're holding it's history. insane to me. Look at this little dish. Look at that. It's like a little... It's oh a my little God, it was, It's a boat. To, like a... Look at that. A collar. Oh, my God. Oh, and there's plates and... What does that say? Does that say Bavaria or Germany? Germany. This one says Germany. Germland. Germland. Oh god, it's so beautiful. What's oh I have to show you my favorite thing in the world. One more. Look at look at this plate. Look at this plate. This little birds. Oh, I might have to keep this. Bavaria. Mm-hmm. 
-hmm. Something. <laughs> is what it says. I will, um, you know, I'll, I'll make some money on that. I don't know. We'll see. Hopefully. Hopefully I will. Hopefully that wasn't a money loss. I don't think it was. I don't think that guy can go to storage. That guy's got to stay here. This stuff? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, maybe. I feel like storage might be too... Storage is too rugged. Storage is for the stuff that can hold up on its own. This stuff needs to be protected. Oh, God, I love it. So, I mean it. I wish I decorated this way. <coughs> I may have to turn my whole house into shabby chic just so I can keep this stuff because I love it so much. Yeah. We'd have a lot of stuff go up for sale. And in contrast, look this at this. Poodle. Look at this poodle. Hmm? 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 Look at him. You know who this was made by? Todd. Todd. Todd made this. Thank you, Todd. Todd did a fine job on this. Feel sure. That? Oh, she's heavy. That poodle's got some weight to her. Yeah. She's listed and I like her. She's got sass. Would you have her list for like 20 bucks? Look at her. Girl. She's ready to party. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think she's listed for about 20. She's pretty nice. She's big. She's a bigger gal. She's a big girl. She's heavy. And she's a standard can, poodle. You could kill somebody with this thing. Really good condition, too. Sure. I had a little chip on it somewhere. I just don't remember. Oh, right there on the back side. No, no big. How, what, how about this bowl? This is a planter that is no big deal, but I would like to point out that I dropped it on my foot the other day, and I do believe that my foot is broken. I don't believe you. It's cool. I mean, I'll probably keep it, actually. You know, it's good. It's got a good drip place. I love it. Sure. I hate it though. I hate it now that it fell on my phone. Yeah, it's got a bad, it's got a bad energy. It's got a bad juju now. <laughs> There's this little fancy lady. She's just a little left-in girl lady. She's more of a, a lady. She's more of a lady. She's less girl, more lady. Right. She kind you know what, too? She goes with She my, goes with the... She goes with my pretty blue stuff. Mm-hmm. Like... My forget-me-nots. I mean, you could list her, or you could just give her as a gift you know to what? the person who buys oh, a large a lot idea. of the stuff. I might do that. You know what? This vanity tray, when it sells, I, I think I'm going to include this homely girl, homely woman in her sure. young, in her early 20s, I'd say. Actually, so she's in her Out looking 20s. for a man. She's doing this. I think she's dancing. With her basket of flowers. Of course. That's how I always dance with she's flowers. A, she's in a really good shape. She's in really good condition. I don't see any damage to her. She's just kind of ugly. Look at her hair. That's judgy. <laughs> nice light. Wait. Tell me. Oh no, she's had a repair. She's definitely going to be a gift. Oh shoot. She's going to be a gift. Isn't she lost her, her arm. arm. Oh yeah, I see it. She lost her arm. I didn't even see it. In the Always store. important to check, folks. Um, this is neat. Careful. Gosh, no one ever thinks chipped. <laughs> You're just throwing Good it around. Lord, look at that cutie. I like that, that a lot. Little, I, I would actually too. use that in my house. I love it. I might put a plant in that. I know it's a teapot, but I'm not putting a plant in it. Yeah, that would look cute with a plant in it. Mm -hmm. That's made in Japan. It's neat. It's like stoneware. It's really cool. I don't know. It isn't marked, but I found other ones um, like this, and mm -hmm. they're, they're Japan pieces. So hmm. I don't know what era that is. It seems earlier than the 70s to me. Doesn't that seem earlier than the 70s yeah, to you? Yeah, my first guess would be 60s. That almost looks a little mid-century to me, but I'm not sure. I really don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what I'll list that for. Probably, I don't know, 20, maybe 20, 25 bucks. I don't know. I played 388 for this set. Here's this. Oh no. Oh no. Dos. Dos. Oh, they're not. I thought they were like stone. Huh. Tres. They're aluminum. West Bend. Oh. Yeah, they're pretty ugly. They've got that harvest gold and brown. Sure. They're the lids are weird. The lids are plastic. Oh, yeah, they are. Yeah. That's 
odd. They're plastic with a with a wood knob. Simulated wood knob. Right. Oh, this guy needs to be tightened up. Oh yeah, these are they're filthy. Yeah, they were used. I mean, I just got them out. They're West Bend. I don't know if you'd say that or not, but they're I would imagine from the 70s. I mean, they're cool. Somebody will like them. They're not worth much. Right. You know, they're worth. I don't know. I'll probably list them for 25. But. Oh, they fit in there all nice and tidy. Um, <clears throat> but even though they're not worth much, there will be people looking for these because there's people that like to decorate yeah. with this stuff. So I like them. It's just not. I actually dig this '70s stuff. I'm not gonna lie to you. Look at this. Look at this neat jewelry. No, yeah, jewelry Ooh. box. It's not musical. Look, it's got alabaster. I it's like got that. alabaster. This is really pretty common. The mirror's <laughs> painted. She's got a little geisha lady on the mirror. It's sure. Pretty neat. And look, she's like almost intact. Yeah. Some of these are musical, some not. You know, these little. I'm a sucker for a musical box. These little doors open. This one. It just needs a little. It needs the little. Hinge um, panel in there. Yeah, it needs the little nails that go on the hinge. Mm -hmm. So that's pretty neat. But somebody who you know, buys this is going to know that. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Or they're those tiny little nails. Mm -hmm. One of them's actually in there. I don't know. I just think it's really neat. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh. I love this stuff. Yeah, I do too. I don't, um, oh, and you know what? Look at that. Don't look like the sailboats were upside down. Yeah. Oh, it's got some wear right there, but that's okay. Okay. It's pretty. It is pretty. Somebody will want this. I hope. Mm -hmm. I don't know. We'll find out, I guess. Yeah. Uh, maybe... this thing. No, you need to understand, I could show you about 10,000 more things. Mm -hmm. I'm showing some great restraint here. This is Wild Hair. Wild Hair by Andrea. Oh, thanks, Andrea. Andrea Sadik. For Sadik. By Sadik. Andrea. By Sadik. Got it. Sorry, Japan. It's a lifelike rabbit. It's a wild hair. Sam, it's meant to be lifelike in the wild. He looks kind of aggressive. Um, I think he looks comfortable. I think he looks like, I'm about to get you. <laughs> get off my law. <laughs> get off my terrain. I am ready to pounce. No. No, I think he looks like he's relaxing watching Netflix. Disagree. Anyway, actually when I looked him up, because I did look him up in the store, I thought he went for more. What's okay. your gut instinct? Oh, well, you know what? I'll probably take mm, 22 for him. Yeah. Which means I'll probably list him around 27. Oh, I don't like the feel of it. I don't like that, uh, ooh, that porcelain that doesn't, It's um, like not glossed. Yeah, it's not glazed. Ugh. Ugh. Uh, oh, I got stuff behind me. Oh, look at this bird. Look at this bird. It's got real feathers on it. Stuff. Pretty neat. cute. Pretty cute. It's not worth really anything. QT. QT. I, in fact, I don't even know if I'll list him. I just want to show him because I think he's neat. And you're really into him. birds right now. I have always been into birds, little lady. I have. It is true, Samantha Elizabeth. It's got like some crazy stamps on the bottom. It's Japan, but sure. I don't know. He's neat. I like him. Cutie. I don't know. I think it's weird that he, I think it's cool, but weird that he has real feathers on him. It is a little icky. <laughs> it's like, ew. Yeah. Oh, it's, shoot. It's a little icky. Look at those. That came from a real bird. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. That's goose. Duck plant. This, is it a duck or a goose? I think that's a that's goose. That's a goose, isn't that? I don't know. We're gonna be really. We look pretty stupid if we don't know. That's not a duck. Or that's, is it? I don't know. That's. I think. Look at him. I think it's a goose. A duck. I think it's a goose. I think it's a duck. All right. Take a vote. Let us know if you think it's a duck or a goose. I don't think comments. that's a goose. I think it's a duck with a I yellow bow. I don't know what to say. And I also think it's a cookie jar. I think it's a cookie jar as and well. And it's citri ceramic. Hmm. Well, Productions Inc. 1984. So, 
I did look this up. I don't know. This old girl will probably be listed for about $30. Yeah, she's pretty cute. She's pretty cute. And she's springy. Yeah. I gotta get it listed right now. I got I went over to my storage to grab some spring stuff and oh, it's holy, abundant. Holy pant. Oh, you haven't seen my car. I haven't gotten the stuff out of my car. You have no idea, my friends. It makes me <sighs> nervous. Um worried. Yeah. All the words, all the adjectives. Mm -hmm. I'm all the adjectives um, connected to worried and nervous. Okay. So, just all that is what I am here at my house right now. Okay, good. Look at this. I'm on this roll right now about uh, picking up. I've been watching that. Flippin' Hippos is, Flippin her hippos. Channel, is her channel. I like her. Okay. I think her name is Star. Cool. I like her. She's super genuine. I like her. She sells, um, <laughs> she sells clothes. Okay. And stuffed animals. Solid. <laughs> I like someone who can make a choice. Yeah. So I, I, uh, there are you people. The we people. Are now apparently wanting things that you had while you were growing up. You were a kid of the 90s. Mm -hmm as are your siblings. Mm -hmm. And uh, so now you want these like stuffed toys that you had. So, you know, this, these junky stuffed animals, plush, that the people call them. Uh, Just call them stuffed animals. No, they call them plush. That yeah, makes me body. This is Kids of America Corp plush bunny. Plush Easter rabbit. I'll probably get, mm, you know what? I think I paid 50 cents for them. I'll probably get upwards of 20, 25 bucks for him. And I have more. I have this huge flamingo in my car. Oh, God. <laughs> it's like this big three foot flamingo. Oh, yeah. no. He brings like 50 bucks. Yeah. What? I think I paid a dollar for him. Oh, my God. Yeah, I'm big into the stuffed animals right now. Now, this is problematic because I really have nowhere to put them. <laughs> So, oh no! I know. I my God! I am on the crazy train. I am not kidding. Yeah. I gotta show you. Uh, I gotta show you this puzzle. Just a minute. Oh, this is my bad children. Sorry. Okay. This puzzle. I'll make this the last thing. Okay. Ooh, I was hoping you would show oh, this. Oh, I love this puzzle. This is so neat. I think I got this. Was I with you? No, so. you know where I got this? I got this in uh, that day I went over to Atlantic. Oh. So it's got the original box, which is kind of cool. Look up there. From the land of Hiawatha. The great teacher. So, Sypho? I would Sypho guess. Toys? I'd say that's a long O, wouldn't you? I would say, or a long I. I, I mean, right. <laughs> what did I say? Long A? Long O. Oh, long O. <laughs> One eight hundred A B C D E F G. Anyway, look at look at all those puzzles. Oh, isn't that neat? That's cool. From St. Paul, oh, Minnesota. Oh, St. Paul. This is where these are really mm -hmm. neat. These are cool. Mm -hmm. Anyway, this one is Young Navajo. Oh, mother and child. Look how cute that is. Oh, Francis would love that. Isn't that sweet? I love this puzzle. That's kind of what my kids looked like when they were born. <laughs> they kind of did. They're Hispanic. They're not. They're not. Yeah, they're Native Mexican. American, but this is super, super cute. Oh, and you know what? I um, this looks brand new. I don't think this has ever been played with. Doesn't I don't that look think brand so. new to you? Yeah. Um, when is this mm. from? Oh, that's an excellent question, Samantha. I'm glad you asked. Um, Didn't mean to put you on the spot. <laughs> <coughs> we can do some research. It's recommended for ages four to seven. Okay. That helps. Okay. I don't know. I would say 60s maybe? The sure. 60s or 70s? I'm not sure. I love the little I like the era. Native American babies I on the side. Too. Did you guys see those? Oh, look right there. Look how cute. And look, it says from the land of Hiawatha, the great teacher. I love the Native Americans. I do too. Ah, oh, so much. We owe anyway, them everything. Yeah, we do. We really screwed them over. So, um, I, I, I'm not gonna, um, 
I, I just don't know. I can, in my quick looking, I couldn't find another one listed. Which for those of that's us good. who are new, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Um, if you find something that's pretty old and you can't find much of it anywhere, that's, that's good. good for yeah. you. Yeah, that's good. And this is, um, you know, so this will appeal to, I mean, there's people that collect, obviously, vintage toys. And Native there's people American that stuff. collect vintage puzzles, kids' puzzles. Mm -hmm. There's, it's got the Native American cross to it. Um, yeah, there's, this will appeal to several people. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, I won't, I mean, it's not going to be ridiculously expensive, but... It, I mean, it's not going to be 15 bucks either. No. But, you know. Right. So, I think... Was there anything else I really wanted to show? Uh, the bears. Oh, these bears. Okay, who are these again? Um, the... Sylv Sylvanian. Sylvanian bears. The so, Sylvanian families. So, there's newer ones that are called, like, calico critters and... Yeah. Oops. There's another, another one. Ones. Calico. You know, there's... Like, then, well, it's, you know, they had, like, uh, or now they have, like, the kitties and the yeah, bunnies, bunnies, and all kinds of different families. Mm -hmm. Back then, I think all they had was the bears. Mm -hmm. So I have, um, I found, um, oh, they have the babies. Here, hold those, would you? So you have your big brother and sister, and then you have the babies. So there's this man, um... Anyway, they're, I don't know, I would say maybe 30 bucks for these guys. I would say 30 bucks. They're pretty collectible. From what I looked at. These older up, ones are pretty collectible. Yeah. I mean, even these if they're not collectible, close, but the new ones are even super expensive. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so, they are. So, I'll, I'll get some decent money for those. I don't know. I think I had a bag of them and I pay, what did I do with that damn bag? You folded it up and put it over there. Where? You see it? Nope. Do you, <laughs> do you see it in the mass? <laughs> Oh, dear God. I, I I wish. You know what? I'll tell you, one of these days when we're just get a little more comfortable, we're going to take the camera around. When we know you're on our side. When we know we have you in our corner. Yeah. We're going to take the camera around so you can see my house. Yeah. You won't even believe it. Mm -hmm. So, I think that is all. Okay. I, again, I've got a million more things I could show, but um, I am really too old. Yeah. And Let us know if your uh, whole city is shut down. Yeah. Let's talk about it. Yeah. I'm, Let's talk I'm about curious. It. What are you guys doing? We're in Des Moines. We have, um... Nothing much is shut down other than, like, big events yet, but... Well... People at stores are going crazy. I went to the store because we were actually out of toilet paper. I have something to share. And they were stocking it as fast as they could, and people were, like, ripping it off the shelves as they were putting it on. It was insanity. I'm not sure what's happening with the toilet paper. I'm not sure what that's all about. This is a respiratory illness, folks. Um, so I went to, I had to stop at Walmart and get some totes for my many, many items that need to be packed up. Sure. And <laughs> there are no totes. Oh, man. Well, the doomsday preppers have to have something to put their stuff in. <laughs> there are absolutely no totes. You know that zombies can't get into totes. I'm not sure. The only thing I could figure out is that um, maybe the suppliers were having trouble. You know, because when something like this happens, one thing leads to another. Right. You know. It's kind of a chain reaction. So maybe the, the suppliers or the shipper. I, I don't know. All I know. The toilet is paper was like Wal the bees. Walmart didn't have any totes. Yeah. So I had to get the huge totes, which I'm going to have to. It, it's going to take four people to carry to storage. It's going to be like a team lift. Once I have them packed. Oh my God. So we're not. I mean. Des Moines is not in um, a full panic mode yet. Yeah, we're not in lockdown yet. No. But the folks I'm are hoping. getting restless. I've got my fingers crossed because I've got a lot of stuff to list. <laughs> and I would prefer not to leave the house for two, three weeks. That'd sure. be awesome. But again, my company is really more about the, get on out there, girl. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck. Good luck. Wash your hands. I think that's all. Okay. Yeah, I get a, you know, I get my gift together for uh, D too. Yes. 
We also need you to like, like, comment, and subscribe. Do all, I'm serious. You need, if you're watching the video, please just, just subscribe. Just, just, just do it. subscribe. It's just it's like that. It's not gonna hurt you. Just boop. Just like you don't that. ever have to watch a stupid video again. Yes, they do. They don't like it. You don't like it. You don't like it. Well, what you really want to do is catch me in a bad mood. Well, I just, I'll edit those moments out. Catch me on a day when I'm in a really yeah. bad mood. I'll probably edit this That's out. That's when you're going to have the most fun. Okay. <laughs> That's what people like me the best when I'm I not don't. happy. Oh, no. Well, because I'm usually kind of mean to you. Yeah. It's usually me. So she's got five kids. It's usually me. <laughs> right here. Oh, we gotta do a we have to do a get to know you video. Sure. Don't we? We'll do that down the road. So if you have questions, start throwing them in there. Yeah. I'll write them down. We'll answer them. Yeah. Let us know if you have any questions about, you know, me, my five kids, my if I've ever felt the need to call adult protective services. <laughs> We'll see. It's a secret till you ask. We'll see. Yeah. You're never going to know. The answer's always going to be no till you ask. <laughs> that right. Anyway, Ooh. well, try it. You know, stay healthy. Yeah. Don't also, get the COVID. Don't get the COVID. Thanks to all of Dee's followers who have come over to watch oh. us. I can't believe how nice you are. You are. And I mean it. If you send me your address, I'll send you a gift. <laughs> I'm serious. Got I will. To share. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I uh, I like the gift giving. I'm a I like the the gift giving. Sure. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna get that done tomorrow. Okay. Okay. Get cool. Some stuff packed up for my girl D. Yeah, I need to bring you over some stuff. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Bye. See you soon.